big one rising up there. Got, oh, look at that. One just hit it in the back of a hole there. There's one in the back. He's gone over to the left. Here comes one. Look, look at the follow, look. Don't take it though. See if you can get yours in over there, just because it's a different lure. This bloody thing's risen in front of that tree up there about ten times. Got him! <laughs> He hit him a couple of times, he wasn't real keen, was he? Nice and fat. Nice trout, isn't he? I oh, hope that'd be great if you could. Uh oh. <laughs> what about now? Alright, uh, see ya buddy. Look at him go. Hoping to go fishing with scrubs tomorrow night. And I know there was a big decent fat trout in this hole last week with your name on it. He was just in front of that little shrub on the left. Right out in the middle of the creek. Now, if he was down the bottom end of the hole, we would have seen him on here. You got him! Ah, oh, oh, Schultz, he's on! I'm going to get the camera out for this. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, no! <laughs> well, that's it. I call that a confidence boost, because then you know now that you're doing what you're doing is right, and it's just up to the fish. I was, I was just about to say, no sunset photos tonight. <laughs> I never take the piss out of people much fishing because I don't like to look like I think I'm better than anyone. Except Wayne Gardner. I take the piss out of him all the time. When he casts, he does the Russell Quick cast. He goes, Psh! I've even seen him whip his lure off the line. And I normally, when he does it, I say, get behind! Have you ever met him? Not the point. No, Wayne, yeah, Wayne Gardner Coit. Uh, no, I haven't. He works at Bachman Batteries. Yeah. Oh, he's a cracker. He's a classic. I've heard some good things about I just got him. Look at the size of him. Jesus. <laughs> Winch the big. <laughs> no one saw that one coming. <laughs> this is what I like about soft plastic. So just... They have that extra natural sort of a feel to them. Look at this. Somewhere in there, there's a camera. I'll just get you to get a, a snap for me if that's okay. I'll put it in on and I'll put it in auto. How's that? Like auto? This came out of the shadows, didn't he? Out of the depths of the hole and grabbed this strike like a nymph. Notice I use the anti reverse a lot. I've been told plenty of times that's not how you do it, but it works. You hear the drag a little bit. I just like being in control. Right, eh, mister? The fun's over. No, it's not, he said. <laughs> he said, I've got other ideas. Or maybe he's a different fish. <laughs> Ah, 
I don't use lift grips on trad anyway. I just normally just lift them up. I was just sort of working the theory. If I get off, I'll, that's all right. I got in trouble for this recently, not wetting my hands. What do you reckon of that, Mr. Schultz? I'll come a bit closer. Can you get a picky for me? Alright buddy, here he goes, the big swim off. Magnificent. That's made me day. Oh, there's a little one. Oh, you hit it again. Jeez, you were small. I had a little one hit it. It's probably only about 15 centimetres long. Got him. You know, soft plastics, eh? I'll climb down and wet my hands so that I don't get myself into any more trouble. Shit. See that? <laughs> I'm always in trouble. <laughs> this is a pretty little trout. Got him. <laughs> Here we go, Chelsea. We're on to a winner. <laughs> Quite a pretty little brown. Thanks for coming, buddy. I'll release you in the sun over here so you can watch you swim away. <laughs> he took off that quick, I couldn't even see it go. Oh, strike, tiger, nymph.